Hi, welcome to BUSN 2039 International Business Management, Module 6, Communication Across Cultures. You'll remember that we have done two weeks of culture in the last two weeks. Last week, we talked about how perceptions could influence our interactions and influence other aspects of cultural exchange. Today, we're going to look specifically at communication. To do that, we're going to explain the value of communication context in international business, communication competence in international business. We're going to recognise options you have for getting across your message, as well as the cultural pluses and minuses related to each option. We're going to pinpoint some of the communication barriers and understand how even language proficiency is no guarantee of lack of miscommunication. And we're going to analyze the sources of communication problems across culture and potentially how to fix them. Right, what do you need to do this week? Read chapter six of the textbook. Look at the videos as we always do. Attend the fifth tutorial, the one about perceptions. And complete, uh, that will in fact be the fifth forum activity, though the sixth forum activity. Sorry, I'll fix the slide. The sixth for an activity. Um, to prepare for the next tutorial, um, you need to do the following. Uh, we've got, we have two activities. The first activity is group case presentations. Um, the second activity is the, uh, a series of discussion points. The other thing we'll be doing, of course, is discussing the forum. This week's all about communication and expectations we have about others. Assumptions about language competence and what language means and how we need to test meaning before we can effectively interact in a cross-cultural setting. And we need to ensure effective communication and reduce misunderstandings by testing our understanding of what's happening. The context is important in communication. Okay, enjoy this module and I'll see you in the Collaborate tutorial.